Right about now, we have the pretty lady I was talking about in the building. <laughs> Jerry Modaka. <Thank> you. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> no. To answer. Should I ask? Wait, wait, no, the scene. <laughs> it's two against one to do I know. Killer time, humble. he's always, you know, against me. And <laughs> when the yourself. other gent is here, I have no say. <laughs> so at least today I have a say. Before we started the show, mm -hmm. I asked him a question. Mm -hmm. He was a very shy guy, honestly. Okay. I've known Nesh Code quite some time. Yeah. Okay. You guys can tell we look alike. You know, we look alike a little they bit. look alike, but they are not related. We are related. How? In the industry. Okay, okay. 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 in the industry. You know? Fine. That makes sense. sense. <laughs> I'm so proud of him. He's coming. I, honestly, if, if you follow Nesh's, Facebook has this thing, I feel changi, I know, 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 so anyway, he's really coming from fun. I'm so proud of you. Uh -huh. Wow. Oh. I know. Oh, at Inesha, I know. 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 I <laughs> okay. he is. But honestly, yeah. honestly, mm -hmm. um, and I know your fans for you have a serious fan base yes. on Instagram and on Facebook. Mm -hmm. Your fans love you, your music mixes are amazing. I'm just saying a kuchocha. Leo, let me just say that, but I'm so proud of you. You're coming from so far. Well, it's been a journey. It's been a journey. <laughs> 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 but for now, let's just talk about um, yes. the pandemic is hitting mm -hmm. everybody. Yes. So badly. Mm -hmm. So badly. And what are you doing to support a family that um, has it a bit rough yes. at this time? So Jerry Modaka, she's just exceptional. Exceptional. Because she's doing a lot. Yani anasaidia watu ukonje, the street families, and so much more. Yes. So... Please introduce yourself. Mm -hmm. and I just want to say, my Kwanza, but let's get to know you a bit more. Tondu na fanya nini? Yeah. I don't have a serious side, so mm -hmm. I hope you're not expecting like a tia, really, really <laughs> formal a, a, a bit, maybe just a bit. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. uh, my name, mm -hmm. as, yeah, Jerry. Uh, I, I, I'm the chair lady for. Um, let me call it a small CBU, a community-based organization, mm -hmm. which, which has risen from another activity, mm -hmm. uh, which it's called Jerry's Kabati. Mm -hmm. A Kabati is basically like a cupboard. Yeah. Where to make and to to go sometimes. Yeah. Okay. But in the US, they call it a pantry. But when you walk you want to watch, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> so a Kabati is where we store our food. Mm -hmm. But in my Kabati, mm -hmm. it's open to the public, mm -hmm. it's free, mm -hmm. um, but it's solely run by donations from mm -hmm. uh, my friends my family members, mm -hmm. these ones, yes. that you are. Mm -hmm. So anybody who's going through a situation right now, like mostly the mm -hmm. example I'm liking to give the waitresses, mm -hmm. hotels are closed, yes. bartenders, hotels mm -hmm. are closed. So those guys, in as much as at Hawana rent, mm -hmm. I want a food. I want a food. You get? Yeah. So it's not a permanent situation there. And they normally work. Mm -hmm. It's just a sahi, mm -hmm. I want a chakula for now. Mm -hmm. So they can always access my kabati, ask me, call me up and tell me. But then I'm going to see me a jamie. Eh? Mm -hmm. They can just call me, yeah. ask me, ukona unga leo, ukona uh -huh. skari, ukona, uh -huh. what do you have in your kabati uh -huh. that I could use tonight? Yes. yes. Uh -huh. So, so it's in just short, that. In, uh -huh. in brief, that's it. That's it. So we've done a few projects so far. Mm -hmm. We are on our third project, which mm -hmm. is coming up, and I'll tell you about it later. Mm -hmm. um, so far, we fed street families. Mm -hmm. Funny story: street mm -hmm. families wa mefungi wa wanalalange siete awana manyumba ni vilatu wa jali parent. So mefungu nyumba three months nini? So so we have a new crop of street families. What? And there are many. There are many. They are in their hundreds. In the hundreds, the street feeding we did on Sunday, we uh -huh. were only targeting 40 uh -huh. because I had done my selections. Yeah, because those ones you can't even control. Mm. So, our 40 who were clean were mothers mm -hmm. and children. Mm -hmm. How their conditions were, we need to rent Havana. Mm -hmm. Give us food, we'll mm -hmm. sort it out later. So, there are people who work, mm -hmm. but because of the situation, yes. they can't, they can't, they work. can't work, so mm -hmm. they don't have rent, mm -hmm. they don't have food. Mm -hmm. So, that is just something that you're doing right now during yes. this pandemic. Mm -hmm. What about before? Ha. 
now before mm -hmm. i'm a humanitarian mm -hmm. that's it's i think it's a calling yeah before i used to not i, I still do mm -hmm. i'm a cancer ambassador in kenya i think mm -hmm. on the same set i, I had come back South yes Haiba. on real yeah. talk yes yeah with i think christine christine yes and we at that time i think i had just shaved my hair I was supporting <laughs> cancer patients uh -huh. i still do uh -huh. so I, i'm a cancer ambassador mm -hmm. and i'm a women's health activist mm -hmm. through the women's health activism is where I met these women and children who are really suffering. We don't have to approach on a health issue, mm -hmm. but you are the see issue. Kama, kama chakula mo. Yeah. You get. They uh -huh. need more of medication. They need counseling. They need mental support. Cause monamke kum support akwe too stable mentally. Atakuwa sawa. Atakuwa sawa. Yeah. yeah. So. What about in terms of um, domestic violence, sexual violence? Oh my God. You maybe, do something maybe, about that yes. as well. Mm -hmm. Maybe I could tell you about our first, first, mm -hmm. first project. The rescue. Ya kufungua mm -hmm. Njeri's Kabati. Mm -hmm. We had this pretty girl, very nice lady. Um, she was being accommodated by a roommate. Mm -hmm. And the roommate mm -hmm. <laughs> decided since I have a boyfriend, for you to earn your accommodation in my house, let's have three sums. You get with me, you and my boyfriend. So the girl walked out, took her little belongings. This roommate was a woman. Yeah, a girl. Eh? Okay. I mean, it's heartbreaking. Yes. Women, yeah. women against women. I mm -hmm. mean, how does it even work? So, yeah, so she called upon the Kabati because mm -hmm. she had heard what we were doing. And he was like, you know what? let's support this lady mm -hmm. and i put it out in the public because that's what we do mm -hmm. we professionally begged mm -hmm. and guys came through for her say she has a new place to stay one year mm -hmm. rent full paid for she she can one year rent one year rent a new place nyumba where we found her was a gutter mm -hmm. place kuna cho kuna warms flowing bad state yeah. i think it's a small video i think i'll send you mm -hmm. after this i saw it yeah yes. you saw the conditions yes. she had no food mm -hmm. she was sleeping on the floor and a mattress and anything. So guys came through for her, gave her a mattress, they gave her food for one year, waka by gas, akapa to a manguo, mm. and in the kabati she can always get food mm -hmm. on a monthly basis. Yes. Yes. Okay, that's mm -hmm. nice. So that was your first rescue. That's Have you done rescue. any other thing that is in the lines with right. um, sexual violence, um, domestic violence? Mm, maybe the one we are going to do next. Mm -hmm. Okay. The third project. Is mm -hmm. it okay if I talk about it? Yes. Uh, it, um, the first project was the rescue. The rescue of the, the young The second girl. one before we even jump to the third one. The second one is the street families. Ah, okay, the street families. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And now don't forget there are individuals. Mm -hmm. See, do what you need. There are individuals calling on the Kabati throughout. Yeah. Like, um, say, mm -hmm. like you know when a man, the day you'll get a family, praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. <laughs> praise the Lord. Amen. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> <laughs> the day you get a family uh -huh. and you have your wife here and your child, yeah. they expect you go out do your DJ gigs. Mm -hmm. They expect for the day. Bring food, yeah. you know. Mm -hmm. Leave a rent. When you want you're the house, you're the man of this house. Mm -hmm. na kupigia na machuzi ya niambia njeri. Don't make me go back home today without food. Ni tafiti tu kaso mbili ni nde home na unga. Ni me pigia otro angu uji sikunne. They can't take uji as like another day. Yeah. You get so there are those individual cases mm -hmm. that we still handle. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so let's talk mm -hmm. about the third project. No, the third one coming up. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. I'm even getting the goosebumps. <laughs> I, I, I didn't believe we've done <laughs> quite so much excited. so far. <laughs> uh, the third one now, we are going to Roy. Mm -hmm. It's a place where they rescue teenagers mm -hmm. who've gone through sexual violence. Oh. They've been raped. Um, some know the fathers. Mm -hmm. Maybe Baba Kenya has raped them. Mm -hmm. Or an uncle has raped them. And... It's crazy. Right now they have 22 girls, 20 babies, mm -hmm. and two are currently pregnant. They don't know their fathers or they know their fathers. So they can't continue staying in the house where they were raped or yeah. in the location. Because what after what uh -huh. You get so they're hidden in that place. It's in right, it's called Wings of Hope Rescue Home. Uh -huh. So we'll be there on Sunday, uh -huh. giving them food, giving them mentorship. They need ladies like you. Yeah. Because those girls are talented. Yes. Two, uh -huh. Again, it's a temporary situation towards their success. Uh -huh. It's like a bump the experience. Uh -huh. So they just need someone to step in the gap. Yeah. 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 And you take them to the next mm -hmm. level. Um, last week I was watching so many of those um, domestic violence right. cases and it's just extremely heartbreaking so heartbreaking yeah. when you know that these people who are preying on yes. you they are people that you know yes. people that you yes. know especially in the COVID it's rising uh, have they risen have you yes. seen the cases rise right it's now it's horrible it's bad at this time uh -huh. it's bad when you and your husband were not seeing each other the whole day. Yeah. So in the evening you have a whole day of 
Tisen quiet, amerudi zioni, pia ako na stress. Mm. Anatole anani stress na hakuna mtu mingine. Akuna. Take it out on your wife. Oh God. Women are moving back home on, on a rate. Ni vile tu guys are quiet. Mm -hmm. But when, I know my friend is doing their research. When they are done with their research work, mm -hmm. trust me, you guys won't even believe it. Rape cases in families, in marriages. It's your wife, but you're still raping her. I mean, how? It's, the stories we receive in the Kabati, too, you're like... Lord, can I even handle this? I need grace. I need. We need to be thankful for. If what? you have a good life, you have good parents. Yes. You have a good husband. Mm -hmm. By the way, on a serious mm -hmm. note, yes. we need to be grateful. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, um, these people, um, the street families, um, this lady that right. you rescued. Mm -hmm. Do you do follow ups on yes. these people? Yes. Uh -huh. Not just follow ups, but pre evaluation mm -hmm. okay. so we can't just support anybody because mm -hmm. we believe our kabati is not, it's not a permanent thing that utakuna kujia food killer siku yeah. najua so before that we ha to stop people from you Kenyans mm -hmm. to the free exactly you know? <laughs> <laughs> yes. food, I'll always go yes. there I won't hustle bus I'm at aniki hustle in a pocket pesa yangu you know and then I go get food it's a Kenyan thing so before mm -hmm. that, what we do to lock such people out, mm -hmm. we try our best to work with with referrals. Yeah. Unaniambia njeri ni liona family kuapa even na hivi na hivi. I we will go. Mm -hmm. We will see. I have my soldiers on the ground. Mm -hmm. They will go. They will see. Or I'll even go there in person. Mm -hmm. And then to know how best. Because um say I'm a kosa hichakula at this point. Mm -hmm. Why? Mm -hmm. Why? So before we take, oh, so we take you in between three to six months. Yeah. We expect in six months you'll be stable. Yes. You get. Mm -hmm. So afterwards, it's mm -hmm. every twice a month. Twice a month we'll give you food. Mm -hmm. In those twice a month, you're receiving counseling. We have volunteer counselors. Okay. You're receiving counseling. Come on, kazi. Trust me. We'll put it out there. Someone will give you a job. Mm -hmm. Or someone will zapu na patado. So the follow-ups are. Mm -hmm. I need your testimony after six months mm -hmm. that you're back on your feet. Yeah, you're back on your feet. That's yes. the follow-up mm -hmm. I'll do with you. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Have you ever had people who ulim idea and then maybe they got a bit relaxed and then they yes. went back to where they were? Went back to a relapse? Yes. No, mm -hmm. not yet. Okay. And I hope and I really, really pray that I don't get there. Because mm -hmm. humans are humans yeah. at the end of the day. But the guys I know right now we have, because we, we are pretty young. You, you'd mm -hmm. be surprised we're only two months old. Eh? No. Yes, <laughs> Jerry's two, kabati is two months old. It's only two months old, but then Jerry, the humanitarian, has been uh -huh, there for a while. You've been there for a while. So I think I've studied the market enough, and uh -huh. I know I know where the sponsors are. Uh -huh. <laughs> I know where the sponsors are. Let me tell you, such people. Uh -huh. You see. Such like a uh -huh. These two, you know that are paid the market in the music, music, but the people who are relying on him for entertainment. Yes, there are many. Ni wengi. Now do ni maybe boss fulani mahali. Mm -hmm. So if I reach out to Nesh and he's my friend, I'll tell him Nesh, from your kind heart, mm -hmm. post this on your page. Yes. Unajua. Post it on your page, help me out. Thanks, but they for coming through all the time. Thanks. Kim to me by a point. I'm sorry for it's for good cause. It's for good cause. Yeah. And I know one day when he's very stable, mm -hmm. at a come through na my dollar, say my men nest. Amen. Nest say my men. My dollar, my dollar na come. I hope yeah. I've answered your question. <laughs> yes, you have. I've just really <laughs> addressed. Yeah. Yes. So maybe who are the people you target to? help out or to chip in in jelly right. kabati or chip in mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and how can two. they get there right mm -hmm. target people are two mm -hmm. we have the donors mm -hmm. or uh, i won't call them partners because mm -hmm. they're not just donating yes they're partnering me in this forever uh -huh. um and we have the beneficiaries mm -hmm. beneficiaries are people now who are benefiting from our kabati yeah. now our partners mm -hmm. are diverse mm -hmm. because i'm not limiting at nambi i'm saying i can only take a thousand bob mm -hmm. i can't mm -hmm. at a hero 10 bob na 10 bob together mm -hmm. unga mob. Mm -hmm. like for example I used my volunteers. Mm -hmm. My volunteers tell me, Jerry, I pesa, but I have time mob on my hands. Yeah. That's all I need from you. I just need your time. So it doesn't mm -hmm. have to be money? No, it doesn't have to be money. Uh -huh. And if it's money, it doesn't have to be like a big a chunk, lot. whatever mm -hmm. you have to give. Wangari Mata is a hummingbird story. Mm -hmm. Kido, 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 mm -hmm. will all make a really huge impact. Yeah, sure. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes, yes. I hope I've answered you. Yeah, you have. Yes. <laughs> if someone wanted maybe to contribute. <laughs> right. To the to Njeri's Kabati, mm -hmm. does it have to be cash? Does it have, or maybe no. I can bring my 
shopping ni kuletea yes. hapo yes mm -hmm. what is it that you take all right so one clothes mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. clothes for the street families and for the beneficiaries mm -hmm. like the girls we're going to see yeah. they don't have anywhere else to buy mm -hmm. and then we have one of our amazing partners his mm -hmm. name is Bugika okay mm -hmm. the company is called Bugika Entertainment mm -hmm. and it's run by an amazing friend of mine called Boogie mm -hmm. right so Boogie gave us his office space mm -hmm. for three months mm. And that's why we will be operating from. Yeah. He gave us a whole fast floor mm -hmm. where people. I know, right? Yes. Okay, your reaction was my reaction too. <laughs> a whole fast floor Whoa. where we can put our stuff uh -huh. there. Nesh, unajo peniko. Ah, as day na. Unajo booki. Like in that door, your fast floor where they'll come somewhere. Yes, it's a, it's a big space. Mm -hmm. If guys can go on social media and uh -huh. see the first video we did, mm -hmm. and we were cutting cake and you know mm -hmm. signing the partnership, yeah. or just like a big boss, <laughs> like two big bosses signing and cutting cake. <laughs> So he gave us a whole fast floor. It's on. It's in Marurui, Thikarude, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. right opposite, no, next to Eden Bliss Gardens. Mm -hmm. So people can come there, mm -hmm. bring their food, bring their clothes, bring um, basically what you use as a human being. Someone else is lacking. Yeah. So if at all you can't reach me on that, you can reach me on my number. Mm -hmm. Is it okay if I give it on Yes, please. TV? I all was right. about to tell you. Share your number. Share the baby. <laughs> Paid, love them. everything. Mm -hmm. So uh, people can reach me via my direct line, and I said my my number is Simuya Jami. Mm -hmm. It's open to public. I'm the one who received the calls. My number is 0703 590 or you can as well go to check out Njeri's Kabati. Njeri, me, Njeri, N J E R I S Kabati. All right, go there, DM me. I'll be there to st on standby. And then our till number is five one eight nine double three nine. Again, our team number is five one eight nine double three nine. Yeah. Kindly repeat your phone number right. and the team number. <laughs> <laughs> okay, my phone number zero seven zero three one 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 five nine zero. My team number five one eight nine double three nine. Or inbox me on my social media pages, Jerry Mutaka on all socials, and Jerry Skabati on all socials. Yes. <laughs> nice. Nimeuza. Kamsa. Nimeuza. <laughs> Or you can still reach Nesh. Oh He's very useful. But then we're to DJ yeah, but he's a very useful <laughs> human. Trust me, very useful human. When I do social media DJ Nesh K. Oh okay. My phone number in a quanga public peer but pole pole chin one seven one nine seven two eight seven one seven. Mm. Thank you, Nesh. So um mm -hmm. thank you so much for coming, Jerry. Thank you. I don't know if there's anything you wanted to say that have to Jafikia. Mm, I can't. I think I've, hey, so you, you've done your research. Yeah? <laughs> you've really done your research. I think you've asked all the questions that people were asking. Yeah. Yeah. Please, um, anybody who wants to reach out to us, um, we need counselors, we need volunteers, we need alongside our partners, um, we need ladies to empower the ladies, yeah. and we need guys to empower the guys because the problems that guys are going through, Miss Yezielewa, Yezielewa, ma'am. Ma, Ma struggle. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> I need mentors to mentor the boys. I need mentors. Also, to come. By the way, mm -hmm. some of the beneficiaries in the Kabati are guys like Nesh. Msi ako too sour. Yeah. Ano neka na kun ako fit you konje, but Daniel. Yeah. Yes. So don't be afraid. There's always someone on standby to talk to you. Um, we pray it's going to go international. If at all. I hope Bugika don't kick us out. <laughs> we pray one day we're gonna have like a free supermarket, mm -hmm. a free supermarket where, in the long-term plans, with a first floor, second floor, third floor, that you guys, uh, it's gonna be accessible to everybody. Yeah, yeah. a supermarket for anyone who is struggling. Yes. You can come in, pick what you pick need. Pick what you want. Yes, and then yes. pay it for it. Mm -hmm. Not just you don't have to. You don't have to give it to the kabati, but just pay it for it to someone else. Yes, out there. exactly. Yeah. and um, I wanted you maybe to tell us uh, your next project is. Yes going to the rescue 31st yes mm -hmm. if there's any woman mm -hmm. who is maybe in trouble mm -hmm. out there mm -hmm. and they're watching us right now right. how can they get to that rescue right. mm, first things first you just talk to me mm -hmm. I, I think it, it's easier when um when ladies talk to me straight because I pick call calls, honestly. I know my phone rings off the hook, but if at all I don't pick, just drop me a message and tell me what's up. Don't die alone. Please talk to someone. Um, in the rescue home, I know kuna restrictions. It has to be between the age of 13 and 19. You have to be a teenager. Okay. Right? Oh, so it's see, only for teenagers. It's only for teenagers. They're teen moms, man. I've 13 years, I've got twins. I've got 13 years. I've got a total. You get So... As a women's health activist, mostly I would answer questions to do with women's health, mm -hmm. uh, questions that you're hushing about, 
you know you don't want to talk to anybody just ask me i'm not a doctor but trust me i think i have a bit of experience first of all being a woman duh. Yeah. <laughs> you know and uh, we have doctors uh, on call cancer patients please we have oncologists on call we have basically it's a small car rescue home yeah it's about a small car rescue mm -hmm. home just talk to someone yeah talk nice. to us that's really nice I, I don't even know. I think today yeah. has been an amazing day. Yeah. We've met talent and then we've met Jerry. I Thank mean, you. Thank you. to have someone who will will listen to you mm -hmm. and will help you out. Kidogo too. Yes, Kidogo too. Wow, it's in life, I think that's all, that's what we need. Yeah. It's a little bit of a help, mm -hmm. a little bit of a push, a little bit of a support. Because even me, Musema, when I came to Nairobi, I had people supporting me, mm -hmm. you know. I had an amazing lady, her name is Susan Laimaru. She's mm -hmm. the Dean of Students at Kenya Methodist University. Nikingia kampo hivi, tu nikuwa mshamba, nimetoka ucha, man. That lady, <laughs> at least Miss Pichangi, nimetoka shago, shago is kwa maiko. Very, kwa maiko. So she, she literally held my hand. Mm -hmm. You know, she showed me the way. So, she's mm -hmm. coming to me to come to me. Sure. Yes. And thank you so much for doing that. Thank, thank you so much for coming through to talk to us about that. Thank we so appreciate. Yes. And we hope that God blesses you with a lot to help so many people. Amen. So many people. Namali Staweza. Yes. We will come through yes, as well. Yes. So, thank you so much. And God bless you. Thank you. <laughs>